Hey, welcome to my channel. So we're gonna talk today about opening a Google account, okay? A Google account is very, very nice. Uh, basically, I call all-in-one because you can uh, back up your photos, applications, YouTube, uh, Google Plus, and everything. Uh, Google Plus, any Google products, okay? So we're gonna start by uh, showing you how to open a Google account. So. Uh, since this phone is not uh, registered on any Google account, you can open it with uh, Google Play, um, Google Plus, or uh, Gmail. So let's say that you want to start with Gmail uh, and see it's actually asking you if you already have a Google account. Okay, and we're, okay, so you're going to just say uh, existing or new. Okay. So we're gonna go to new. You already have a Google account. Just uh, enter, enter uh, choose existing, enter email and password. So we go new to open a new one. So just select your name. Okay. All right. So name and last name. Okay. So just go next. And uh, choose your username for your Gmail, okay? Just hit the arrow when you're done. Checking availability. Okay, that uh, username is already taken, so uh, touch for suggestions. You can use a suggestion or just go to. Uh, delete that one and to select another one you would like and see if it's available so just uh, play numbers and words that you would like to use and see if it is available you can change anyone you like okay so just uh, touch try it again uh, do not touch skip 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 because uh, you choose skip then you want to take you back to the main uh, uh, start over again so just go try it again to use that username they select you so now uh, use the passwords, okay? Password. Um, I suggest you to use a capital letter at the beginning, some uh, six uh, word of six letters, six to seven letters, plus uh, two or three numbers, okay? Okay, so let's choose the password with the um, capital letter at the beginning. And same password you type on the uh, at the beginning. Type double, well, three enter it. Okay, same one. Okay, so you will get that message if you misspell something there. So you just retype it. Okay, so now we already passed the password. So just Google password recovery. On this step is very important. Uh, you would like to uh, just set up recovery options. That's very important. You can use an email address. You can use your phone number. And what happens is that if you uh, get to forget the password, um, they will use your phone number to send you a, a security code or a phone call to give you uh, the uh, security code to uh, access to your account and uh, restart the password okay so it's very very important also if you set up an email then uh, you need to know the password of that email in order in order to be able to log in and uh, open the link which which uh, google will send you to reset your password password okay so just for now i'm going to choose not now but uh, just if you hit that one just you will be able to enter phone number and uh, email address so Google services on so backup and restore is very important to keep it on because uh, any contacts that you uh, store in this phone will add automatically uh, back it up to your Google account. So that's a secure way not to lose any contacts and uh, videos and pictures and things like that. So keep communication up to date. Um, Google periodically send you uh, email uh, about new services or new products that they launch or any of your applications uh, 
uh, they will send you notification about it so if you are us using your uh, phone data uh, you may need you may need to turn this feature off if, because each time they send you notifications uh, you're using your data package on your carrier so if you don't have one to maybe uh, overuse your phone I mean your data and you may just uh, um, go to connect in Wi-Fi and check status on your email if there is any uh, news from Google maybe um, a better option for you so for now I'm gonna keep it uh, on but if you want to turn all that, that, that issue you can do it okay so just uh, go to next and finish account just accept terms and conditions Google you would like to read it just uh, click and open it okay and uh, click I accept because uh, if you hit the don't get account then you will lose all information you already store on your phone and open and, uh, this account okay so you have to start over again if you hit not now okay so you're gonna take a few minutes um, to load any um, so then this step you we have to enter this uh, um, message which is a G E S S S I and if you misspell it uh, Google will send you another um, other uh, uh, word to for you to type in order to pass to this uh, step. Okay, so we already passed this step and waiting for sync. Um, your email will appear shortly. So that means that uh, because we start from Gmail, uh, you will be able to see some welcome message from Gmail on this uh, this step. Right? Okay, so we are now here on uh, this uh, main folder and if you see any uh, social that means that any notifications from youtube from google plus and if your facebook uh, is uh, registered with this in gmail address that means that you will get notification from uh, facebook or twitter in this area promotions any promotions you will receive from google and uh, so just a primary you have three emails right now Let's see if you can see it okay so okay so in this step um, you is a welcome from gmail tips to get the most out of gmail bring your contacts and mail into gmail find what you need fast much more than email okay so you can store contacts uh, with their informations like family, relatives, friends, um, organize okay so here's a uh, uh, tutorial on how to use and, and, and what else you can get from Google it's, it's very very important for you to understand and read these uh, steps Okay, so this is the creator account. Okay, let's uh, so let's go to Google Play. The Google Play. Um, in order for you to download applications, uh, you need to register on Google Play uh, as well. Okay, so automatically it's registered on Google Play, so you can start downloading applications. Um, okay, it's from Facebook, uh, WhatsApp. YouTube and also any games like music if you want to download music and next the uh, next one will be is Google Play Google Play it's at uh, least like a um, another so it's like another uh, social uh, site okay and on this one you can uh, meet communities uh, with your interest um, and you can join and join them and receive notifications 
uh, maybe traveling, food, or uh, um, technology, or news. So let's say you can you can join this person and follow her, um, and also this uh, this uh, bell does the notification. So any uh, news from your communities or even you receive any contact in, uh, request or something uh, Google Play will I mean Google will not notify you on the your own bell so um, this is okay so we already went through to um, Google Play Gmail Google Plus let's go to uh, uh, photos photos uh, is very very nice okay so any pictures you will take on this phone videos uh, it automatically uh, back up to your photos if you register so you need to register just clicking on the icon okay at the bottom says no thanks or sing in so just hit sing in and automatically uh, detect your uh, Google, uh, Google Gmail I mean account and you don't need to enter uh, anything else I think you, they will ask you just your name. Okay, so your name is, is appears on the app. Just go to select gender, and then uh, accept terms and conditions. So you can read them and create account, create a Google profile. Okay, uh, so these are the terms and conditions. Um, it's very important for you to know your privacy and just uh, proceed anyway. Okay. Okay, so there you go. It's singing in. Perfect. So this is how backup your photos and videos so over Wi-Fi or mobile network. If you uh, don't want to use your uh, carrier's data package, which is you have on your rate plan. Um, just hit over Wi-Fi so only connect only do the backup when you are on Wi-Fi and if you want to do use both Wi-Fi or network then just leave on the first one okay the phone not gonna be over Wi-Fi only because uh, you may need to may want to save some uh, data from your carriers package that you have on your right plan so just um, um, just uh, you have to check turn on if you want this uh, leave on it doesn't matter if you took the first one or the second one you have to turn this one on okay so another uh, is going to be ready to uh, do the backup okay so now at the, uh, the task is backing one, one left and include your google drive photos okay so that means that you have any uh, photos with google drive also will download to your uh, new application so just uh, make sure to this leave on and show drive photos but just go to no things okay so uh, this uh, this uh, step I uh, see your stories the other um, nice feature from Google is that they automatically create uh, any slideshow from your pictures and videos also they create a story from you according to the timeline timeline of your uh, backup uh, multimedia so the okay, case so, uh, this one is um, it has uh, one only one picture so far so if I go to my gallery it's a gallery gallery right here I only have one picture right so now I can go to my photos and um, I have my picture here also so now I can just go ahead and go to gallery and delete that picture because I already have one here, so that that where I can uh, create more space on my internal internal memory. Uh, so this is the nice part of Google uh, Photos. So um, yeah, so basically this is this is Google Photos. Okay, all your pictures and videos will be back up in this area, and just go ahead and can delete them. But make sure make sure uh, before delete them to make sure that. Uh, they already back it up on your Google Photos. Okay. Now we're gonna go to YouTube. Let's talk about YouTube. Uh, YouTube. Also, it is already 
um, created with the same email or Google account that we just barely open. So. Okay, so right now we are we are uh, seeing the old version of YouTube. Okay, so we just go ahead and go to Google Play and uh, update it. So let's go to Google. If you get that, uh, if you get that uh, Google, or you have problems like the message you saw, like say that unfortunately Google Play, I mean YouTube have stopped, and then that means that uh, you need to come here and update it. So just find YouTube. Okay, so YouTube is here and uh, you see that it says update that means that you need there is an update uh, on these applications when you don't see uh, when there's no update and the application is up to date uh, you won't see an update option option okay uh, so in this case we have this option to update it so just is open or update let's hit update okay so you see permissions, just accept terms and conditions for the update and this will take a few minutes. Okay, so now we see that the uh, uh, YouTube is already uh, updated, so just open it. Okay, and just go play service update. So I'm gonna take a few minutes also. So any... Um, Google products I need to be need, need to be updated. Just uh, hit update and you're ready to go. Okay, so this is the new uh, look of this uh, YouTube version 2016. Okay, so if you get any different than that, then you may need to update it from Google Play. Okay. Um, Okay, so this is how it looks. So you already have a channel also in this area, so just can uh, add your videos uh, to keep it on YouTube. Uh, so YouTube Home and start searching a uh, channel. Uh, okay, and if you would like to, to uh, search my channel, just. Uh, Go to search, enter C L A B D I O space leadership, and then search. Okay, and that's my channel. So just welcome. You're welcome to open it, and you are welcome to subscribe if you would like to. I have uh, videos on how to have reset, uh, master reset. Uh, some other features, audiobooks, so you can just subscribe on my channel you like to. And okay, so this is a YouTube. Okay, um, what else we miss here? Okay, so we just went through Google Plus. Google Plus, to if you have any talents and you would like to share to other with others, such as uh, you already have a profile created on Google Plus, so just share uh, your talents here. With communities and we went through Google Play, Google Photos, YouTube, Gmail, um, just go to right now Google Maps. Okay, Maps is very, very nice. I love the navigator, the GPS, I mean, in this one, just accept terms and conditions. Like I said, already you already uh, have an account, so you, you have all these features at the same time. Just yes, I'm in or skip for now. This is very important because. Um, if you want to know what restaurants, what gas stations, or what stores are near you or around you, 